fantastic time when I, I took a break, uh, flew to California at the end of April, and I got to see my relatives on my dad's side of the family. I learned so much about who they are and what they mean to me as far as what um, part they, they play and who I am which is amazing. Um, my grandmother is uh, a very joyful woman. She has an intense, joyful side. Um, very funny, very happy-go-lucky. And my aunt has a, a very, um, more of a serious side, which is interesting. So, um, it was fun to share with them what I'm doing now and what I plan to do. Hopefully, they will be able to attend my graduation this year. And um, I'm still hoping and praying that I'm meant to finish this program this year. It would be awesome. And get a job in the fall teaching or doing research. My writing is coming along much better. I think I've learned a lot about writing over the last year or so, which has really helped me. And I'm becoming more willing to do the work. Sometimes um, I just wasn't, didn't want to do it. There's a lot of days that I don't want to be positive. There's a lot of days that I don't want to write or work or see people or you know makes make science fun there's some days where I just want to go to the park and do do as little as I can and that's okay every now and then but um, you have to be willing to do the work um, one thing that happened today at yoga class that was amazing our teacher didn't show up and a lot of us were just doing a lot of the positions by ourselves because there was no one there to show us and we were there so we thought you know if you're if you're right in the room you might as well keep working so we were working on our positions and a lot of um, us were just kidding because we don't know all the positions and I was giving a little bit of advice as to um, how to make a stretch produce a lot more um, length in your hip area and one of the girls asked me if I was a dancer which was so cool and I said no I'm not a dancer but I was very proud that she thought that I was and um, it I think the lesson in that to me is is not that I look like a dancer, but it was that um, I think if you're in the process of doing the work, that um, it's pretty cool to have someone think that, you know, if you're doing the work and people will see that it's you I think that's what I'm trying to say for instance if I am writing and organizing my work and making things happen and putting in the the hours and the drafts are coming through and I'm putting together different sections then it's very easy for me, for someone outside of my reality, to look at me and say, you must be writing, you must be writing a thesis. Now that's a good thing for someone who's outside of my reality to look at me and say, I think you're a dancer. I think you're, you're, you love, I think you love exercise. I think you love writing. I think you love public speaking. I think you love people. 
to have someone else give you the acknowledgement of an act that someone else recognizes in a positive sense I think that's really a a, um, a positive thing um, I would like people to be able to look at me and see that I am finishing my thesis that I, I look like I'm finishing my thesis I'm doing what it takes to finish my thesis and to me that's that's important so um, with that that's probably one of the um, and I mean another example if you're if you're a vegetarian people can see from your food choices that you're a vegetarian you don't have to announce it it's just what you do and I think that's that's a good goal to have is that it's it's very easy to attract what it is that you want to do if you're doing what you want to do and in my mind you know I want to be healthy I want to be flexible and people look at me and they say wow you know you're doing what it takes in order to do that and that makes me happy so <clears throat> I hope everyone is having a great day and I'll catch up with you soon Bye.